around six years ago I made a video on how to make texture paste at home and I've been asked so many times can you make it with a color paint instead of white well I'm here to tell you you can and I'm going to show you how easy it is to do the link to the texture paste recipe and video is in the description box below all you need to do is then swap out the white paint for your color paint I've just mixed it together now I'm making a very thick paste and why I do this is because if it's too thin when you put it through your stencil it'll just spread out and you will not get this beautiful raised effect now here's a tip if it's too thick don't add water add more paint whether it's white paint if you want to lighten it or the color paint if you want to thin it down a bit and here's why my test run had a blank piece of paper under it look at the moisture on it this has just come through from the paint and the glue so if you added water it would be way worse so whatever you do you do not want to add water add paint only here's another tip to stop it from drying out while you're between using it just put a piece of paper towel over the top of the jar and spray it with water and this will save you from having to put the lid on and off on and off now all you're going to do is pick out your favorite stencil and start using it I've picked out a blank journal page and I'm just going to put my stencil on an angle and put a, a blank sheet of waste paper underneath it and put it on my scraper I'm using a wide scraper and this is going to allow me to really get a good pressure on this thick paste I'm just going to spread it out and scrape it off lift it straight up and I can leave this to dry if you haven't tried making your own texture paste get the recipe and give it a go because I can tell you now you're going to love it whether you choose to make it in white or a color and a final word make sure you wash your stencils get them really clean because this stuff's got glue in it and it will dry rock hard and you don't want to ruin your stencils.